Have you, so have you been to Shelter Cove before? They call it the Lost Coast because it's basically like this really long stretch of coastline that's totally inaccessible. I, mean, I always like these things well, where it's like, one, this is sort of the only way you get there yeah. or something, you know? <laughs> Do we have to put our phones in airplane mode? Absolutely not. So we're heading to Shelter Cove today. Tons of traficic, ends up being a little complicated. We're showing us tell Papa the to talk to San Francisco Tower for transition through there, Bravo. So probably either just around the north side of SFO or right over the top, whichever is easier. We can do the one on one transition. 400 now back. 12 o'clock. Yeah, yeah, that boy, bro. Less than one mile. Find okay. some cool views, good food, and a little hike. Hello, Otto Ground, Bonanza 367, Hotel Papa. Is ready to taxi. Uh, we're we'll back uh, looking for flight following to Shelter Cove. That's uh, Zero, Quebec 5. Uh, Bonanza 367, Hotel Papa, Palto Ground, runway 31, taxi via Yankee 1 Zulu. Yankee, Yankee 1 Zulu to uh, runway 31 uh, for Bonanza 7, Hotel Papa. Bonanza 7, Hotel Papa, expect a straight out departure, squawk 4524, four, and expect San Carlos Tower next on 119.0. Okay, 4524, 1907, Hotel Papa. And the 7 Hotel Papa, hold short of Yankee 1, contact tower. Hold short of Yankee 1, contact tower, 367 Hotel Papa. Tower Bonanza, 367 Hotel Papa, is ready to go, hold short of Yankee 1. So, Tiber, 60 Golf, are you able to make a short approach? Unable, 60 Golf. 60 Golf, Roger, make right 360. Right 360, 60 Golf. Bonanza 7 Hotel Papa, straight out runway 31, clear for takeoff, no delay. Okay, straight out runway 31, clear for takeoff, Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa. Just a five my tango, follow us to target, 12 o'clock, turning cross and straight to the downwind. Plenty of rare. Is that five my tango? And as a seven hotel pop, because the rare you're doing a bait tour uh, through the Corbella? Uh, seven hotel pop, yeah, we're just kind of headed northwest bound there. And the seven hotel pop, Roger, contact San Carlos Tower, 1 100.0, good day. 19 0, seven hotel pop, see ya. And San Carlos Tower, Bonanza 367 hotel pop, I'm through 1000. Bonanza 367 hotel pop, San Carlos Tower, are you doing the 101 transition? Uh, we can do whatever works best for you. Basically, we're just we're just heading northwest bound. We can even stay out of the service area if that's uh, easiest. Bonanza 367. Uh, I see your destination's at uh, Oscar Quebec 5. I'm just not familiar with that. Where that is? Uh, where are you headed? That's Shelter Cove, zero Quebec 5. Uh, it's just up the coast, uh, 150 miles. Roger, and you want to talk to NorCal? Uh, yeah, that's what we'd like to do for 7 top up. Roger, if you want to head towards the coast, you can cross over the field out above 1,200. Yeah, we can we can do that. I mean, I guess we, basically we just we just want to go northwest bound, so probably either just around the north side of SFO or right over the top, whichever is easier. We can do the one-on-one -on -one transition. Roger, if you want to continue on your head, uh, present heading, uh, that's fine. Uh, maybe turn right uh, slightly. you got a Bravo shelf ahead of you about 2 miles, 1,500. Yeah, we'll be below that for uh, 7 hotel pop. And if we can get a Bravo clearance, we'll take it. Otherwise, we can just go around to the north. Roger, I'm, I'm uh, giving you a handoff to NorCal now. Stand by. Seven o'clock, thanks. Bravo. Bravo. Support, Low. Bravo. You got Less a Bonanza flying at 1,400. No back. 12 o'clock. Have Less than one mile. Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa Contact NorCal departure 125.35. Have a good day. 2535, so don't pop. Thanks for the help. NorCal Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa 1,400. Number 36 Hotel Papa, NorCal approach, IDENT. IDENT, 7 Hotel Papa. We're still in Hotel Papa D.A. to talk to San Francisco Tower for transition through there, Bravo. Well, our, I guess our question was, we can either go around to the north of the service area or through, whichever is easiest for you, but we can turn north. Uh, yeah, turn north. Let's plan for transition through Oakland's class Charlie. 7 Hotel Papa. So we're 7 Hotel Papa. Remain outside Bravo Airspace, Oakland, altimeter 3025. Connect Oakland Tower 127.2. 272, 7 Hotel Papa, good day. Oakland Tower, Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa, 1,400. That's 367 Hotel Papa, Oakland Tower, proceed direct to the runway 30 numbers here at Oakland. The Oakland altimeter is 3025, climb maintain VFR 2000. Okay, 2000, 3025, direct to the 30 numbers, 7 Hotel Papa. Member 7 Hotel Papa, contact tower on 118.3, after 30 numbers, proceed to Oakland Coliseum. Okay, 30 numbers over to the Coliseum, uh, 183705, good day. Where's the Coliseum? Coliseum is... Oakland Tower, Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa, 2000. Is it a stadium that's like right over here? Oh yeah, right there, so straight ahead, like right off your... Okay. Yeah. Oakland like, Coliseum yeah. and join the 880 Freeway Northwest line. Yeah, it's basically uh, the uh, football Bonanza, and baseball stadium. Bonanza 7 Hotel Papa, what's your on course heading for the destination? Uh, it'd be about one, uh... 10 five. About uh, 315 for 7 Hotel Papa. For 7 Hotel Papa, Roger, proceed to Oakland Coliseum and join the 880 Freeway Northwest line. 
Okay, over the Coliseum, uh, freeway northbound, uh, 7025. Yeah, you see a massive parking lot right there? Okay. And then the 80 is like the thing that's basically right on our side of that stadium. Gotcha, so that's the freeway. Yep. Cool. There's just a ton of airports all right in the <laughs> same spot out here, so it's... And tons of traffic ends up being a little complicated. You're splitting, like, two major airports. Right. And then all these little airports in between. It's like literally every minute you're just, like, talking to somebody else. But it's fun. Nice little view of the bay. Today is a 7 Hotel Papa, contact NorCal 9 on 127.0, good day. 270, 7 Hotel Papa, good day. NorCal Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa, 2000 calling for the uh, freeway. There are 367 Hotel Papa, NorCal Approach, on navigation appropriate VFR out, please. 7 Hotel Papa. And now we just kind of sit back, relax, we'll be there in 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> We've escaped the airports. 3028. Yeah. Number 367 Hotel Papa, no observed traffic between you and Shelter Cove, Arcade Altimeter 3013, Squawk 1200, and Frigus Kane's approved. 7 thanks for the help, good day. This is cool down here, like with these rocks on the shoreline and stuff. Yeah. yeah. So I think we're getting pretty close to where like the road's going to kind of go away. Not quite, but I think it's like a little further up the coastline. So have you been to Shelter Cove before? Uh, I've been once. We we did the like the backpacking version where you get okay. dropped off at like the northern terminus of the Lost Coast and you hike down to Shelter Cove, which is the southern terminus. Gotcha. What do they call it, the Lost Coast? They call it the Lost Coast because it's basically like this really long stretch of coastline that's totally inaccessible. And so uh, you know, Highway One in California basically goes up the coast for for the most part, okay. with very little exception. And then this section is like the exception where you, like there is no road and you can't make any roads. So yeah, I can see why they can't build a road here. Yeah, look at this. It kind of just drops off to the ocean, you know? Yeah. And you got all these ridges and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, very steep. So there's like one single hiking trail <laughs> that basically goes along this. That's probably our little point over there. Yeah. That is uh, Shelter Cove. Shelter Cove traffic, but in the 7 Hotel Pop is 8 to the southeast. Gonna be a right downwind runway 1 2 Shelter Cove. This is really cool. This is literally, like, from here, this just feels like this is in the middle uh, of nowhere. And it really is. See, like, how going north is just kind of a wall. Yeah. I mean, it's like, you know, it's not a cliff, but it's a pretty steep wall. And it just goes all the way around that point, and there's nothing. It feels like a, a setting for a horror movie to me. Kind of does, right. yeah. Just like this little coastal town right. isolated by itself. And you see how the sand is like black sand? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. Is it just, is it actually sand or is it like more like clay or something? That's a total sand beach. Huh. We're gonna walk down to it. Very smooth. Very smooth. Uh, not that smooth. <laughs> <laughs> you see those golfers? Yeah. Were there? Yeah. They were looking at us like, why are you landing? We're trying to golf. <laughs> You're in our driving range, man. Yeah. That's what it kind of looked like. I think we parked by the porta potty. Toilet paper just flapping in the wind. Yeah. What a good parking spot. We'll park uh, upwind of the porta potty. <laughs> Okay, we made it to uh, Shelter Cove. It's a little windy, a little cold, but uh, we got a little restaurant over there. Get a bite to eat, explore a little bit. With an airplane, you never quite know what you're going to discover. The variety of places, people, experiences is endless. And some of the most beautiful, unique spots on the planet 
are virtually inaccessible any other way. Aviation ties the world together and expands our horizons. It shows us what else can be, and there's nothing more fun than bringing friends along for the adventure, sharing those encounters with other people. Shelter Cove turned out to be an extraordinary oasis set between unforgiving seas and harsh cliffs, a place of tranquility in the midst of relative chaos, its beauty unique in almost every way. And if I tried, I couldn't have imagined this place with these people in this time. So that was a pretty cool stop here in Shelter Cove. That was a good suggestion. Yeah, it was. This place is awesome. Now I'll take off, watch the sunset, head back to Palo Alto. Okay. Couple deer on the taxi. Three deer. Oh no. There's one oh, by that sign there, running. and then there's oh yeah, there's two over there, and then I think another one on the taxi right there. You know how smart you suppose those deer are. Shelter Cove traffic bands of seven hotel pops. Running runway one two Shelter Cove. You guys all set? Adios, Shelter Cove. Well, I guess we've seen the coast kind of up close. Maybe we should uh, see if we can see the sunset. Uh, Oakland Center Bonanza 367 Hotel Pop is off of Shelter Cove, looking for an IFR to Palo Alto. Number 367 Hotel Pop, Oakland Center's clock is 3253. 3253 Bonanza 367 Hotel Pop. Radar contact southeast of Shelter Cove and uh, the Akai altimeter is 3016. You're clear to the Palo Alto Airport via leaving 5100 direct. Climb and maintain 7000. Okay, leaving uh, 5100 clear to Palo Alto via direct, maintain 7000. We're climbing through uh, now 5300 Bonanza 367 Hotel Pop. Roger. Number 7 Hotel Papa, at this time you're cleared to extend, which is Sierra Tango, India, November Sierra, for the point radius 3 arrival. To extends for the point radius 3 arrival, 7 Hotel Papa. Number 367 Hotel Papa, contact Oakland Center, 127.8. 127.8, 7 Hotel Papa, good day. Good day. Now the 7 Hotel Papa, descend and maintain 5,000. 5,000 in the Seminole Hotel pop I think that's the airport right down there. Oh, okay. Yeah, approach Bonanza the Seminole Hotel pop it has the airport in sight. And uh, full stop, 76 pop. Full stop, 76 pop. It's been kind of quiet for a little bit. Yeah, it's pretty quiet. Approach Bonanza 367 Hotel Pop-Up. Bonanza 367 Hotel Pop-Up. NorCal Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa. 376 Hotel Papa, NorCal approach. The Salinas, no, San Jose altimeter is 3020, so your destination and your present altitude. 3020, I think we lost approach on 351. We're about uh, 7 to the southwest of Palo Alto IFR at 5,000 feet, heading 110. And we have the airport site. Number 367 Hotel Papa, copy, I see you there. Contact approach 120.1 now. Okay, do 120.1, 715. Probably be able to see uh, the Apple circle. Yeah, approach Bonanza 7 Hotel Papa, has the airport in sight. 
Ben Anza, 367 Hotel Pop, and our caliper. I understand you have the airport in sight. Did you want the visual approach in Apollo Alto? Information X ray. Affirmative. Ben Anza, 7 Hotel Pop, it's clear visual approach on 831 Apollo Alto Airport, sir. Clear visual approach on 831 Apollo Alto, Ben Anza, 367 Hotel Pop. Chairs 367 Hotel Pop, about the tower. Yeah, Are you able to enter our left base from your present position, or do you need to circle above for altitude? Uh, we're going to make just a very slight S turn, but yeah, we can basically call this a left base. And as into Roger, enter a modified left base right through. There is traffic abeam you in the right downwind. Assess now, altitude so indicates 9 or 100. They'll be following you. Okay, we have the traffic on downwind, and uh, we're basically turning final now for 7 Hotel Pop. Traffic, 11 o'clock, low, 1 mile. Fernando 7 Hotel Papa, wind 170 at 4, runway 31, clear to land. Runway 31, clear to land, 7 Hotel Papa. 5 Mike Tango, turn based, I'll be a departure ahead of you, wind 170 at 4, runway 31, clear for the option. 31, clear for the option, turn base now, 5 Mike Tango. That's a 5 Mike Tango, we'll still try to repeat for one departure. Fernando 7 Hotel Papa, no delay to the end, search taxi via Zulu, is a parking? Zulu going to transient, 7 Hotel Papa. That's a bride familiar? Yeah. Send to Rev Zulu, Yankee 2, suggest Juliet, monitor me on ground, good night. Zulu, Yankee 2, Juliet, over to ground, 7 Papa. Yeah, so it was a pretty fun day flying. Uh, and excellent uh, choice there in, what's it called, something cove? <laughs> Shelter cove. Shelter cove, there we go. <laughs> Even though it sticks out in the ocean and is not sheltered in any way. <laughs> Gonna drop everybody back here and might head down to Harris Ranch for the night. Guests may arrive by car or by plane. Hi there, do you have two rooms available tonight?